Ladies and gentlemen, welcome back to the channel. Today is gonna to be a lot less of a formal video, more of an aesthetically pleasing video. If you watched my last video last week uh, on the Charger, Dodge Charger RT, um, you're gonna see a lot of comparisons. This is the Dodge Challenger two-door 2022. Okay, very similar um, interior, very similar engine, 5.7 liter V8. Um, and so today what I wanna do is I wanna please you guys uh, visually, I want to please you guys sound wise with your ears. And I want to go through this real quick and make this a really fun sort of visual video. Okay, so let's get into this one. All right, so right quick, let's just cover a couple of little, the, the differences between last week's car, the Charger and the Challenger. Take a look at the front grille here. Take a look at that. Really, really menacing sort of front grille. Same hood scoop. Same little yellow sort of drag strip stuff going on, but a very, very menacing. Look at the way that thing stares at you. That thing comes up behind you with a big V8 engine. You move over quickly. I love the look of this, even more so than the, the Charger. Again, you wanna see that Charger video? Hit, hit this, uh, the link right here and you can head right over to it after you're done watching this one. All right, more differences. Two door versus four door. Look at the slick lines of this bad boy. Look at that. Obviously a little bit little bit bigger doors to maneuver, but the size way lower, the ability to, to sort of move around, twist and turn, um, get traction is on par. Same menacing gargle of that V8, 5.7 liters. Really nice touch here with the fuel cap. This is done a little different. Looks very drag strip-esque. Interiors are almost identical. This one's a little newer. Oh, down boy, down boy. All right, driving impressions. Uh, this thing comparable to the Charger last week, much lighter, same power, um, but much, much lighter, much more nimble, much more sporty on the road. Um, this one's a little, this one's a little newer, so I'll give it a little VA. This guy forgot to go with the light. This thing has got so much grunt, so much grunt. Um, so yeah, a little bit more nimble, a little bit more, more sort of sporty-esque. Um, it's a muscle car. It's a purebred Dodge muscle car. Straight line performance. Yesterday it rained a little bit and I tried to put the power down. Couldn't go, couldn't get it to do anything. It wouldn't hook up at all. We're talking 350 horsepower in this thing, but couldn't, really couldn't get it going at all. Uh, but straight line performance, when it hooks up, when it's dry, this thing's badass. So steering feel, you know, it's it's a little bit soft. It's a little bit sort of, you know, what's the word? A little bit light. Um, I don't get immediate sort of feedback. I'm not really feeling the road that much, um, but it, it does have a sport, of, sort of sports car vibe to it. The, the seats are very bolstered. You know, the cockpit is very sort of snug. Um, it's very in, it's very set up for a sports car sort of enthusiast. Um, that being said, I'm not I don't feel one with the road. I give it a couple turns of the wheel, and it's not it's not real tight like a scalpo like I, what I would expect. Sound for this car, huge huge win. This is why you buy this car. Huge 5.7 V8. Um, naturally aspirated beast of a car, right? This car's a bit of a bully around the around the road, right? You can bully big trucks, you can bully little cars, you know, everyone kind of gets out of your way, right? It's super cool, super fun. Suspension on this car is pretty rough. It's a little two-door sports car, I shouldn't say little, it's a two-door sports car, feels all the bumps, right? You go over bumps, it's very, very sort of rough. So, as I said in, in my previous videos, Option out the good seats, option out the leather seats, option out the, the optional higher quality seats, and give your give your bum a little bit of comfort. This car competes with the Camaro, competes with the Charger. Obviously the car Charger is in the same, um, you know, it's made by the same company, so they aren't really competing, but um, it's gonna compete with its German counterparts, M4, you know, C63, Audi RS5, but I don't think that it's on the same sort of level. 
Um, and it's it's a muscle car, right? It's you know it's giving you tons and tons of power, tons of grunt, tons of emotion. I buy cars for my senses to be heightened, right? I want to look down, I want to see beautiful things, nice gauges, nice um, digital rev counter that goes up quickly. I want to hear a nice big V8 engine, downshifts, right? I buy it for my my senses, for the enthusiast in me. Um, this car certainly does that for me. It's been a serious joy to sort of live with. Again, if you want a comparison, go check out my Charger video. Uh, same same engine, same sort of you know vibe, same sort of enjoyment, but in a four door sedan, heavier, more practical sort of package. So definitely go check that uh, that one out as well. I'll link it right here uh, above. You can just click on that. So final thoughts: muscle car, badass, super cool car to, to be in for the package price. You know we're talking 45, 50 grand if you option her out. SRT model, we're talking 60, you know, you get a little bit higher, Hellcat, it's giving you a different experience, bonkers fast. Um, I think this is a nice sweet point. This is the RT, gives you the big V8 engine, comes in a decent price point, fit and finish is pretty decent in here. Uh, I think this is a great everyday sort of car for a young guy who wants to get sort of, you know, good vibes, wants to get a good feeling when they're ripping around, uh, around town. It's certainly a, a bully of a car, it's certainly a badass car. So um, I definitely think it's a, it's a good buy. It's a, it's a cool car to buy. Uh, definitely have a look at it. If you're in the market for, for a muscle car and looking for something a little bit higher level, a little bit more V8, um, I definitely have a look at it. All right guys, so that's the V8 Challenger 2022. Uh, if you like the video, hit subscribe. This is a badass car. I'd highly recommend it. Let's do a little pull. I'll see you in the next video. Baby. See you in the next one.